Welcome to the Real American Road Trips podcast series from ICAST 24 in Orlando, Florida. On this episode, I sit down with Hobie Eyewear, maker of my favorite pair of glasses. Y'all check it out. You know, down here at ICAST, there are a lot of great companies, a lot of great products, and one that I'm actually familiar with is Hobie Eyewear. I actually own a few pairs, and I absolutely love them. So it's a real cool pleasure to have Stephen and Dylan from Hobie to sit down and talk about some of the products. And I'm not saying that just because you guys are here. I actually love your eyewear. So tell everybody a little bit about, you know, Hobie Eyewear and where you guys have started from and where we're going. Yeah, absolutely. So we've been making eyewear since 1982. That Hobie. long? Yeah. Okay. Believe it or not, uh, yeah. 1982. Yep. So Hobie, obviously born on the water, started in surf, went to Hobie Cats, now doing kayaks amongst many other water sports. So if you're spending a lot of time on the water, you need a good pair of polarized sunglasses to For cut sure. the glare, yeah. see beneath the water, and keep yeah. your eyes protected. Yeah. So... Um, like I said, good for anyone in the water, no matter what type of activity, but especially fishing. We have a lot of really good offerings for that. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So, you know, I think Hobie Kayaks, where we're from in North Georgia, huge brand. A lot of I got a lot of buddies that are kayak anglers, you know, and they love the Hobies. When it came to the eyewear, though, I don't think that that many people knew you guys had a quality product as far as the glasses and everything. And then when we started wearing them and guys were seeing them, I'm like, no, oh, these are legit. You definitely need to check them out. And you guys got a lot of different offerings, you know, different styles for, you know, whatever purpose, different lens colors, you know. So say somebody um, saltwater fishing. Mm -hmm. What kind of lenses do you guys offer as far as color, you know, the... Yeah, yeah, so um, for saltwater fishing, so generally speaking, the way it kind of works with our lenses is a gray base lens or a gray lens. So it could be the gray or the gray with our cobalt mirror. So we actually have a sample right here yeah. of that exact coloration. That's right, yeah. And um, this is a great um, lens for saltwater fishing for when you're out in the blazing sun all day and you're not really getting any like uh, any like um, escape from the sun, yeah. right? Um, I, for more uh, like freshwater fishing, we recommend like a copper yes. or a copper based lens, like our copper with sea green mirror. Right. And I'll show you a and sample. That's what he's, he's got, got right, one right there. there. Yeah. yeah, perfect. And then uh, our Sightmaster lens is good for salt and fresh water. It's um, a great low light lens. It's great for like flats fishing. Yeah. So this is honestly, <laughs> I run into a lot of anglers who just wear this all day long. I have that. Yeah. I have that. <laughs> yeah. Yes. It's, I, I don't... It's, it's an amazing, amazing lens for me. It, it's a little too bright for me during the middle of the day, so I, I, I'm kind of like a copper sea green mirror guy and then sight master in the lower light conditions. Yeah, so, you know, being a freshwater guy, freshwater angler, especially where we're from, take bed season, for example. You know, guys, that's when it, we hear the talk about glasses, sunglasses, being able to cut through the water, trout fishermen up in our, you know, mountain streams and all that, certain lenses and all that. I have the sight masters, and I like them. I love them, but I am a copper color guy too. Personally, for yeah. me, that copper just kind of, for my eyesight, is what cuts through the water the best. But they all look great. Yeah, the copper, so so for the viewers specifically, what the copper does is, whereas like a gray lens, you know, we recommended that for salt water. A lot of times when you're in salt water, unless you're fishing in the flats, it's not about seeing in the water that much. You're not doing too much sight fishing. But when it comes to fresh water, being on the streams, fly fishing, spin fishing, whatever you're doing, fresh water, there's a lot of looking for the structure, whether yeah. it's not to tag a rock and you're with your prop or looking for structure or literally sight fishing the fish. The copper lens is a contrast enhancing lens. So what that'll do is just make different colors pop. It's also, it's kind of funny when people first put it on, we always get to like, wow. Yeah. And it's it's like, it brightens everything up in a, in a very counterintuitive way, you'd think. Mm -hmm. It kind of brightens everything up, but it's um, a very soothing lens. So I love that copper lens, yeah. and I particularly like the look of the sea green mirror. Yeah. So I'll wear that all the time. And uh, yeah, that's my go-to lens. I, again, unless it's low light conditions and I switch yeah. over to the Sightmaster Plus. Regardless of how good your lenses are, if you don't have fashionable looking frames though, that's what kicks it. And, and, and in the fishing industry, you want to look good. Of you course, know, they always say, yeah. if you look good, you feel good, right? Exactly. So, so now you're seeing it, you look good. Like y'all got definitely the sports lenses, but kind of like, you know, his frames right there, you know, the fashionable lenses and all that. So I, I have those, you know, and I love them. I look good in them. 
And yeah, I, that's our coastal sunglasses. Yeah. And that style there. I look good in them, guys. I'm telling you. <laughs> but, you know, I get told I look good in them. But that's the cool thing is people like, those are good looking glasses, you know. And so you can get a sports lens in a fashion, if you want the fashionable ones, yep. which I like to call my out on the town glasses. Yep. And then I've got, you know, these style for when I am fishing and all that. But y'all, y'all have some that even float. Yeah. Right? So, well. so actually what we were just talking about, yeah. that's a perfect segue to this style here, Monarch. So this one is the perfect on and off the water glass. So as you can see, it's got side shields. It protects a little bit from up above. This is a floating sunglass. Yeah. It comes with a super comfortable, adjustable neoprene um, retainer. But then the beauty is when you're off the water and want something that looks good off the water, side shields come off, I'll retainer be comes off. Look at that. And so now this is kind of, I call this sort of like action mode or sport mode. And then when you look at it from this angle, it's like a regular like lifestyle a transformer, sunglass man. Yeah. coastal glass. I and love that's that. Monarch. That's our style Monarch. And that's a floating sunglass. Is that something new for this year? Uh, nope. This one's been out for about three years, I think. Really? Okay. I hadn't longer. seen that. Oh, Makes man. perfect sense. Because, you know, the way we do when we go out on a location, uh -huh. we do some fishing. And, of course, we're about, when we're done fishing, let's go find a good place to eat, you know, hang out yeah. with the guys and all that. So to be able to transition from that on the water to what I call my city, you know, my city attire. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty neat. I like that. Yep. And we have that. We have this style in three different colors. The other two uh, colors, it comes with a black frame. So it's okay. even more wearable off the water than maybe this metallic silver. Yeah. But a lot of people really like this metallic I silver. I understand so. that. Now, spending a lot of time on boats, guys lose two things on a boat. Their cell phone uh -huh. and their sunglasses, always. So you guys got the floaters and everything. Yes. So And is that what you're holding right there? Do those yeah. float as well? Yep. So this is our style blue fin. Um, yeah. This particular style that you see here is the Hank Cherry Signature Edition. I know Hank Cherry. Yeah, I think absolutely. he's sitting behind you right now, he's actually. Yeah. 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 I'm not, I'm not kidding. He's right, he's right behind yeah. you. Uh, How could you not know who Hank Cherry is? <laughs> and if Hank Cherry wears them, it's got to be good. So this is um, our double XL frame, blue fin. Yeah. So this is, you know, we, we got a lot of requests for people said, I love your frames, your floating frames, your styling's great. I just have a big melon. I need like a little bit bigger of a sunglass. You got a fine I, cranium is what I call that. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah. We came out with this glass and it has been an instant hit right out of the gate. Absolutely. And they all look great. Now, for somebody that's just starting out fishing, they hear us talking about Hobie. They want to go get a pair to try. The best all-around frame, you know, lens, what would you guys recommend for so, that guy till he gets to learning something more specific? Yeah, so honestly, you can't go wrong with anything in the floating collection. Yeah. You're getting an insane amount of value. You're not going to lose those sunglasses. The lenses are top-notch, premium, polarized quality. Yeah. The quality of the sunglasses is right up there with brands that cost two and $300. We retail for 80 to 110 and we have a lifetime warranty. So that's important. Pack all that value together, it's it's unmatched compared to anyone else. So whether you're someone that's worn an expensive pair or tired of losing them and you just want to have a pair, spend less money on it that you're not going to yeah. lose or get two pairs for the same price as that one or someone that's buying cheap gas station sunglasses and you want to step your game up to the next level. Right. We're the perfect brand for you. See, I think that I think you hit the the nail on the head there is like the guy I connect with is your weekend warrior, yep. your average guys. We got a job. We like to get out there when we can. And spending a lot of money on sunglasses, when you can do the same thing, get a quality pair for half the price, and then you can spend your money on other things. Like you said, get two pair of them. Exactly. Like that. That makes more sense to me because, you know, there are certain companies that will price you out. They'll price people out. It's unfortunate. So I think that's really good of Hobie to, to hit that market, that, you know, that group of guys because there are, Far more of those than there are anybody else. Yep. And so that that's good. And uh, like I said, they look good. They look good. So yeah. what does Hobie have coming down the line? You guys got anything maybe in the future you're working on that you might be dropping? Yeah, we got some really big projects we're working on. So yeah. come this time next year, I think you're going to be pretty blown away with what we have to offer. So we've been working on it for a long time. I can't say too much about it yet. Right, but, but, but you know, we got stuff coming. It's a good time to keep an eye on Hobie Eyewear. You know. Oh, I th well, listen. I love mine. I, <laughs> I, can, love mine. I can I can add a little bit that's not so secret. Yeah. Um. Our our floating collection has been our best story to date. Yeah. So we definitely already have plans of expanding that. Uh. This year we added two new styles that were existing non-floating styles. Uh. Snook and Everglades. Uh. They proved to be a huge hit. 
with the consumer um, in the non-floating version. And we're like, let's figure out how to make these floating and make them even better. So right. we added those two. We have another style called Eddy, which is a uh, bottom rimless style for people who are like a little bit more of a sport frame look. Yeah. You know? Um, so we're going to be expanding the, uh, the floating collection a little bit next year. And there may be one or two styles that we're going to create the next evolution of that style next year. So, so is that Hobie Frames you got on right now? Yes. So, so, so here's what I'm noticing. I got my sunglasses, I mean, uh -huh. my glasses on and I'm looking at them. Those are good looking. Glasses for a guy, you know, yeah. wear those to work and everything like would, that. So you would, you would like a pair of glasses like that. I would love a pair of glasses well, like that. Look what we got for you here. You brought gifts. Your you own pair gifts. of Hobie Duo sunglasses. Duo sunglasses. Duo sunglasses. And they have your prescription. So here, hand me that little clip you see right there. Yeah, I'll, I'll let you. Yeah. All right. So, because I wear the same. Oh, no, actually, you would have the smaller ones. Okay. I can't, I can't demonstrate with my glasses. Okay, so you want to show me with that? Right here. Yeah. So this is actually our crescent. So it's a little bit smaller than the ones I'm wearing. Right. They're closer to the fit of yours, which is why we went with these. Okay. And simply put, magnetic clip comes off. I'll be daggum. Put it back on. Are you serious? And we've supplied you with one of every one of our lenses there. So you have the gray, the gray with the cobalt, copper, Copper with the sea green and our Sightmaster Plus lens. Well, I'll tell you what, you guys have a customer for life. You know, I mean, that is awesome because, like, I seriously didn't know you were doing this, but I was looking at your glasses thinking, like, I've had these for a couple years, you know? And yeah. I'm like, man, those are some good looking, good looking glasses. Yeah, feel free to try them on. Do, well, Give them a spin. Yeah, absolutely. You guys are all right. Good Lord. <laughs> Those yeah, good on they you. look, Those well, look really I appreciate that. They feel good. I can yeah. actually see. So that that's pretty much, i tell you what, guys, that's awesome. Y'all didn't have to do that, but no, I appreciate it. it's our pleasure. It's our pleasure. And I cannot wait to get out there and try all the lenses and everything like that. So not only will I look good, I will see in the water. I'll see in here. So you know, you now have six sunglasses, six glasses in one. So you have your everyday glasses yeah. that you can wear doing podcasts, working on your computer, doing whatever. And now you have five clips for all the sun situation. So you're outfitted for any conditions at this point. You guys are all right. I tell you what, Absolutely. by far the best <laughs> experience I've had so far in, in interviewing people here. So, but in all honesty, I, thank you very much for that. You didn't have to do that. No, absolutely. You know, but really honestly, to. seriously, the glasses, I got your glasses last year, by far my favorite glasses. And I've had those expensive brands and I've had those convenience store <laughs> brands and I have had more compliments on my Hobie sunglasses than any of them by far. So Excellent. I would love know, to hear that. I, absolutely. And you know what? I appreciate you guys doing that. And I'm going to wear them on my episodes, man. It's going to be good. Excellent. See if we can sell you some of them. <laughs> <laughs> appreciate you guys coming by. Absolutely. Take care. You're welcome. Thanks, a lot, buddy. Thanks for having us on. Appreciate you guys.